Alright, hello guys, welcome to episode 5 of my 120 star run of Super Mario 64. In the last episode, we defeated a couple bullies, did the red coin star of Lethal Lava Land, and got ourselves up to 40 stars. So, here today we're going to do Red Hot Log Roller. Which, a quick way of doing this instead of doing it the proper way, is actually just to grab your wing cap and uh, fly over here, then fly over the cage, grab the star, instead of trying to get over there, run over the log. Oh, it just makes life so much easier. And then we just one, and a two, and a three. We just up a little bit, and straight down to the star. Because fuck doing it the proper way. Why would you want to do it the proper way when you can do it a much easier, quicker way? It's just how I'm looking at it. Red Hot Log or Roland. Save and continue. And what is next? Probably one of the uh, in volcano ones. That's the only two left. Hot foot into the volcano. Hot foot it into the volcano, I should say. Oh, but look, now we get a little shell. That's going to be very useful for when we want to get the 100 coins later on. That's fine. Get in there before I start shooting shit. Alright. Now this is actually one of the stairs as a child I used to have troubles with. Over. Jump. Nope. I think it's just because of the certain part where you gotta go off of a couple of sticks. I think you gotta jump off them to get to the star, or jump off them onto each other. I always used to over jump it, guess wrong of where I should be jumping. Shit like that. I'm just gonna get rid of him. So he doesn't fuck with me. Right here is where I think Ace had the most trouble. Just trying to get the jumps. Whoa, okay, I don't want that though. That's fine. And we got the star. So now there's only the one star left here. I don't think it's as... I think it's easier, but for some reason, sometimes it seems harder. Let's just see if we can get the last one of this area. See what we got. Elevator tour in the volcano. So lots of in the volcano things here today. But we will be done with Lethal Lava Land here in just a moment. Which is good. This is one of my not so... I don't know, I'm not so fond of this level, exactly. And I've never been a huge fan of Lethal Lava Land to begin with. It's cool design and stuff, but I don't know, just not overly into it. So, up these, I don't know what these little fucking beads are supposed to be, other than just showing you where it's going. I don't overly think you need that. And next one. I'd also like to know how these elevators are floating in the air. Just a little something I'd like to know. Okay, so dodge that fire. Climb up, climb up. Okay. See, this one I find is just a bit easier. Okay, so now we got to be careful with our jumps. And apparently I was not careful enough. Son of a bitch. Now we gotta go all the way back up. And instead of making you all suffer through this elevator again, quick cut. Alright, we are back. As you can see, I did die once trying that, but that's because I found a quick little shortcut. Instead of going on the first elevator, you can just jump in the lava and boost yourself up to the second one. Uh, but I died trying to get it done the first time, but it got it done here. But there, we got the star. We are done with Lethal Lava Land until I gotta come back for 100 coins. I'm happy with that. So next, I need to decide, should, I think, instead of going there, we're gonna go to the Shifting Sandlands, I do believe it is called. Yep, the Shifting Sandland, and we need to, in the Talons Bird, in the Talons of the Bird, I was going to say in the talons bird, but that would make zero sense. And a lot like uh, me doing a series on a game that n pretty much everyone's done also doesn't completely make all the sense in the world, but I don't think I care. 
I enjoy playing Super Mario 64. I enjoy doing the series for you all. I'm gonna do it. So I gotta get that little fucker. So we're just gonna go on top of this pillar. And I fell off. Get up. Run up it. There you go. Stay up here. And boom. That is legit all you gotta do for this one. You think? Oh, fuck. You think it'd be a little harder? Or he'd give up a little more resistance? Or something, but no, he just kinda lets it happen. High score! Of course. Now, I'm not sure which one's next. None of these are that hard, though. I'm shining atop the pyramid, so just the one that is sitting right in the top hole of our pyramid. Which, pretty easy to get that one, too. All we need is our wing cap again. We can fly right to it, instead of doing it the proper way and running up the pyramid. So who wants to do it the proper way? Noah, when you can take shortcuts and speed run through this game as quickly as possible. And... Here we go. We get five and six minutes. We might be doing more than ten stairs today. Getting a little extra credit, I suppose. Now, if it's eight red coins, that one's also easy. No, he wants us to go inside the pyramid now. But, I'm thinking before I go in there, I'm gonna do the eight red coins. Something that's less of a headache. Fuck! Because it really is so much less of a headache just to get the red coins for now. I missed one at the start, though. I'm gonna have to go back for that. I'll get them now. Okay, one, two, three. I missed that coin. Okay, get two. I'm gonna go this way. We need more wing cap. I will get that coin. This is just not going as smoothly as I had expected it to go. Okay, we're fine. Oh my god, this is just not going well at all. Grab it. Get over there before we end up out of cap. A little overzealous here. Oh, we made it. Come on. No, oh, come on. We were right there. Yeah, this, this starts taking up a chunk of time now. Grab that. We're gonna go back to the starting area. Grab the coin way back here, where if we fuck up even a little, we're, we're dead. See, just like that. We will end up in that quicksand and dead. Just grab it. Don't be... Don't be pussy. Just grab it and run. And fly. We're gonna run out of cat. Right before I want to get up there, too. Yeah, we made it. Okay. This music's probably gonna drive some people nuts. Jesus, we haven't let it run out yet. It seems like we've got infinite wing cap right now for some reason. We really shouldn't. Oh, I know where the last one is. Whoa, okay! Mario, calm down there with that flight. Holy fuck, he nosedived. Oh. Now we gotta go all the way back. That 
fucking bird. If he grabs me, I'm dead. Come on. The hat should have run out by now, I would have thought. Why is it lasting so long? I'm just gonna give it a second here. There it goes, okay. No. We don't get infinite cap, good. Here we go. so I don't have no cheats or nothing. I'm not doing that. Oh, alright. So now all that's left is the headache stages and then a boss level. So, once again, instead of doing two of the headache stages, let's just go do that cool boss. Which means, everyone, we get to listen to more Wing Cap music for now. I bet everyone's excited for that. So, now this was something that I... It took a long time to find as a kid. Like, I had no fucking clue. That, uh, even with the star name, because as a kid I didn't read shit, I just clicked stuff and did them but that you're supposed to ask slam on all of these pillars and it'll open up the top of the pyramid for you to enter. Like, who would have figured that out as a kid when, like, you don't read shit, you just kind of do? Like, if you were a kid and you read it, well, then you'll probably definitely figure it out, but... Let's just fly over to it. There we go. Boom. And in. Now, I could just jump out and grab the star right there that quick, which actually isn't a bad idea. And I might possibly do to get that star next instead of trying to climb the whole thing. But here we go. Hieroglyph things. You jump on him and he goes, holy shit, it's a creature with eyes. We, who walk here? Who break seal? Who well, awake ancient ones? We know like light. Rumble. We know like intruders. Now battle. Hand to hand. Nope. 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 No one said that this fight was hard. And just like that, it is done. I don't even know who the Ancient Ones are. Now take the Power Star, we sleep darkness. I didn't read the rest of that because I kind of forgot and skipped it. I don't know if they're ever in any other Mario game. I don't know, nothing. They're just weird to me. Kind of an anomaly. Yes. So, no, it's looking like we will only get the ten stars uh, this episode. There's only two left, and then... Oh, there's only, yeah, there's only two left. Okay, so, now we're just gonna, we're gonna do that same thing and see if it is possible to get that star through the top. If not, we'll just have to continue from the bottom. And it will mean I've wasted a little bit of time. And another one. And another one here in a second. Skidoosh. And we opened it again. The ancient ones who don't like the light are going to be very pissed with me, apparently. Yep, just like that. Much easier than climbing the whole pyramid. So now there's one left, and this time I'm going to go about it the proper way, maybe. I could probably do the same thing, but all I need is five certain coins in there. Just so that we all get to see what the inside does look like, I am going to do it properly this time. Actually, that tornado might be helpful. Yes, now we can just go over. Instead of doing a risky thing, I'm just gonna try. 
Here we are. All we need to do is get up to about the top again. We can, if I do this jump just right, yeah, we could skip a little part, a little section. Make this as quick as possible. So we need to get to the top of this little sand slide. And get all those... See that coin there? That'll be a special coin, apparently. Where we can either fuck up and get all of them, and have to do it again, or nail it and manage. Let's just hide in here and go. I mean, see, climbing this, it's not hard. It just... It's annoying, and if you screw up, you gotta do it all over again, kind of thing. It's just not fun. It's just much easier to get the star the way I did it. Son of a bitch. We're pretty much there now. There we go. Okay, you stupid. Okay, this guy's pissing me off. Okay, let, let me up. There we go. Christ, it's the most trouble I've ever had with that. Okay, so, we want to be careful here. I just want to drop. Now, the next one. Next one should be down here. Okay, so we need to do a little hop. We need to do a little hop across the sand. Barely made it. Another one just across the sand. Okay. Now we just need to land in the sand. So that's all there is to that. It's annoying. And if you screw up, you gotta travel all the way back up. But not bad. And there's the star. We go. Now we can even screw up and grab the star, which I have done and have seen people do. Just like we're about to do. Okay, now we, we're okay. That was very close, and I was gonna freak. I score. So now we just need one more star for the episode to be complete. And I'm thinking of going in here. Uh, I forget this is Hazy Cave. Well, Hazy Maze Cave. And we don't get that unlocked yet, but it is very useful for this area. Now I'm gonna get the quickest star I possibly can in here. Which is another one that I had trouble finding as a kid. But have since honed my Mario 64 skills and, uh, know exactly where it is at all times. Ow. And just like that, we got a star. We have 50. And actually, we have enough time now to get another one. You received 50 power stars, now you can open the star door on the third floor. Uh, oh, you have found all the cap switches, haven't you? Red, green, and blue, the caps you get from the colored blocks are really helpful. Right along now, the third floor is just ahead. Even though I know it is. Uh um, we're not going there yet. Because we're going to do right quick swimming with the beast in the cavern, and then that'll be the end of this episode. Meaning we got one extra star than we needed to. Getting a little extra credit going. Because why not? As I said, we're gonna, it, as much as I love doing this series, I'm trying to get this series complete as quickly as possible also. Because I've got other projects coming up that I want to do, including one that I'm going to announce probably relatively soon to you all. Um, because I think I'm going to start that series as long going with this and uh, the Doki Doki series, even though Doki Doki is kind of on a pause right now. I think just because I'm too lazy to record it. And then, of course, um, my Knife Edge Nose Gunner, which is just going to be me periodically playing it whenever I feel like playing it, recording it, and showing you guys if I get any much further. 
So that series could go on for a long time. Just a heads up. But boom, we got the Beast in the Cavern Star. And I do believe this is where I'm going to end this for today, so please comment, like, subscribe, tell me what you all thought of this episode. Hope to see you all in the next episode of Super Mario 64. See you then.